Oh, who the fuck is this? Really? Now we're fighting people? these people? This looks easy. Don't get careless. These things look like the things, the spinny things look like the heads of bunnies. Like the decapitated heads of bunnies. I was too late. The fight. Concentrate on the fight. I need to stock up on a shitload of life bottles next chance I get. Like 90 of them. <laughs> I got a little worked up. Still can't cook anything, huh? Eh, still can't cook. Fuck it. Told me to use the tent, we'll use the fucking tent. I was gonna try and hold on to it, but it told me to use it, so we'll use it. Bonnie, you want to chase after me? Eh, well, this will be a good e experience boost. All over the place. This is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> We're done. All right, let me see something. Skills available through Equip Magic Guard Item Pro. Oh, okay, 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 let me see something. Let me see something. Okay, so, no, I think I... If you noticed on the last time that I, I entered the screen, some of the, um... Some of these things had a little gauge. Sorry, let's see. They had a little gauge that looked like it was slowly increasing. I think that stuff that you, you you get by equipping the weapon. Once the gauge fills up completely, you learn the like the skill. I 
think that's what I'm gathering. Yes, I think that's what happened. So once I get new weapons, maybe there'll be new new shit. But like I have to fucking, you know, learn or something like that. Like you, we'll be able to see it when it comes out. But now where do I go? Do I go over here? I guess there's something that I'm supposed to be. Yeah, I'll, we'll encounter like all these guys. Oh, I should have checked it. Don't get sloppy. Shit, we found some stuff, huh? Oh, whatever the hell this thing is. Don't get sloppy. Okay, so I wasn't supposed to go this way. Battles, huh? Let's get this over with. We're done. Uh, we'll encounter Wink. Don't get in my way. Do I need to spell? No, for me it's purely the sword stuff. So I know no magic. Damn, once you get up to those mages, they're just fucking, they're defenseless. They're pretty much Estelle. <laughs> like, she's good from a distance. But when you get up to her, you just fucking lay waste to her. Yeah, she's like, she's like, oh shit! And then she runs away, and then I just wail on her. I finished them off. Huh? Oh, I feel so powerful! Nice. Oh, I gotta go down. Uh, 
Let's see if we can counter wink all three of these. Come on, bro. Uh, I only got one. Let's get this over with. The cry of victory. I wasn't running from that guy, just in case somebody saw me fucking see that guy and then straight dip. It's just because I realized that over here is where I need to go. Let's see if I can wink these guys. Oh, they're all gone? Yeah, so. Let's go to work on these mages. Cake. Don't get careless. Damn, a lot of these cats, huh? I find it a little bit morose, I think is the term, and like disturbing how when you like kill one of these bandits, they like try and get back up and then they can't. <laughs> See, look at him, he tries to use the sword to like level himself up, and then it's just like, can't do it, and he dies. See, watch. See, look at him, it's just like, up, 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 and he struggles to get up. <laughs> Or she struggles to get up. I don't know. Yeah, I think they're he's. Aren't they? Are they he's or they she's? Let me see. Let me fight another one. Let me link these guys together. There are so many. Wipe them out in one shot. I don't know. They're wearing like midriff bearing shirts. Which in like. Japanese RPGs are usually typical of like female characters. Damn, that hurt. It's not over yet. But then again, they don't have any like. Oh shit! Kill me. They don't have any like chest, chest though. I mean, I'm not trying to say that like. I am. I'm dead again. I'm not trying to say that every woman has to be like some fucking buxom, you know, like has to have fucking double D's or something. Let me, let me look close. Yeah, I would say that's a man. We're done. I would see that. I would say those characters are male. It's difficult to tell. But I would say that they're male. I mean, it obviously matters to nobody but me. <laughs> Sorry if I hurt you. But... What's the term for if you can't tell if something? Is it male or female? It's a something. I can't fucking remember the word. Oh, oh, did it tell me to check something? This looks easy. Don't get careless. It's not ambiguous. Ambiguous just means it's hard to tell. But there's like a specific word when like something can be of either race or of either sex, I Only should say. Years. I don't know. And we're here. Uh oh. Foreboding music. Port town Kapua Noor. Kapu Noor. Damn, I got some deep foreboding music. Damn. Man, the 
the weather sure changed in a hurry. It was right. Did you see that last scene? Apparently, somebody in the bottom right-hand corner was kissing the ground in front of a man. Let's find an inn before we get soaked. Still, what is it? I don't like it. Is what oh, she's gonna say. I, I just thought a harbor town would be more lively than this. Yeah, this isn't exactly how I imagined it either. But it feels like the kind of place that core thief you're looking for would hang out. Decky was headed for Torum Harbor. I'm sure the two are pretty similar. No way. It's only Nor Harbor that's scummy like this. What do you mean? Nor Harbor is... It's all because of the Empire. Yeah. I told you what would happen to that little brat if you didn't have our money. Hey. Yeah. Please, sir. Not that. Please give me back my son. Damn. You got fucking kidnapping in this bitch? With this awful weather the last few months, we haven't been able to launch the boats. Surely you realize, sir, we can't hope to pay our taxes like this. You'd better hurry up and capture that rip girl beast then, shouldn't you? That's right. If you sell his horn, you'll never have to worry about taxes again. How many times do we have to tell you? Savages. You tell him, Rita. Fight the man. Is that the sort of scum you were talking about, Carol? Yeah, the Empire's influence is really strong here. I heard things got even worse with the new magistrate. He's some Imperial big shot who does whatever he wants. Which means there's no one to complain to if his henchmen act like that. <sighs> but how can that be? That's enough! You're hurt! You might even get yourself killed this time! But it's our son! If I don't go... Ugh. What are you trying to do? Oh, so sorry about that. I didn't see you there. Yuri! My apologies, sir. Let me take care of that. <laughs> I can't afford this treatment. Don't you have something else to say? Huh? Jeez, you guys been robbed of your manners along with your money? Uh, I'm sorry. Thank you most kindly. I don't understand why it was just a penis to them. Parted with everyone. We were kind of douchebaggish back there. Hey Yuri, don't wander too far and get yourself lost. Is there nothing for us to do except watch our son die? I had, I had no idea this was happening in Kapu Noor. The Empire's standards must be low to appoint someone like him. We're suffering because of the Consul. We're not in business right now because the Magistrate gets a percentage by way of taxes. someone dressed all in black wandering around he was really suspicious and to think he's the executioner hired by the hired by the magistrate I really don't like the era that we live in era era good day do you want to know about synthesizing type of item you most likely be synthesizing often are weapons this is because there are lots of skills attached to weapons or weapons are often needed as raw material for, as raw material for synthesizing new weapons. I suggest you don't discard or sell any weapons that come your way. On the other hand, old armor is not necessary in synthesizing new armor, and it's better to sell old armor first when short on gold. On gold. Some stronger enemies might drop raw materials. 
insisting you hit a poison charm with a 50% poison defense from an antibiotic material. Come check back to see if you can use these raw materials to synthesize something special. I think I already fucking um, read that in an earlier part, which is why I kind of skipped it. It's just a synthesis. Scarf, giant beetle. Hit from the wool of sheep living in an area with dense air, keep you very warm. So is this supposed to like, like, do I say, hey, I want to get that scarf, and then I go fucking, I go find, like, the giant beetle, and then I go, like, you know, try and get it from him? Is that what the whole thing is supposed to be? You look tough with these on, feels just like being a grown-up. Jacks that requires both hands to handle a simple battle type axe. I'll let you know when there's new information, check back often. Welcome, have a look at our wares. I. Uh, yeah, so I said I was gonna go to work on fucking. Holy bottle, 11, dark bottle, bottle, see what attracts enemy. Matt, simple Matt, use in camping outdoors restores 25% of max HP and TP. Yeah, I might as well get go with five of these. 15, 15, Panache bottle, keeps both physical. Keeps them handy for, yeah, I'll fucking go five on those. Life bottle, I got a shitload of those. Holy bottle, didn't mean to increase those. Those is what I meant. Okay. Alright. Now let's let's dip. Taxes are high and the shop is not profitable. Could you please buy more? Damn, dude. This fucking council or whatever the fuck he's called. Here's the back door. I got in. Heart it looks like a man's handwriting. Dice Master's house. Oh shit. Oh man. All right, all right. <laughs> Damn, am I supposed to get killed by these dudes? Because they're laying waste to me. And they were never heard from again. Oh, no, I wasn't. <laughs> they just kicked my ass. Fuck, dude, how far back did I save it? Oh, I think it was pretty fucking deep. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we are back! <laughs> now, most of you won't understand that, but I just fucking... I probably cut... I probably did cut, so that this is right after it. But, what happened was, I went down here, I got my ass kicked by some robbers, or some, like, people in shrouded... Trench coats or assassins. Trench coats. So badly that I thought I was supposed to get killed. But it turns out I'm just terrible and I did no strategizing. So, let's fucking try this shit again. Let's get this over with. Fuck, it's coming down to it. Nice! It's not over yet. Nice! 
I barely beat him, but I did. Flynn look like he has like he's like leaning back. <laughs> he's got like a gangster like backwards like leaning going. That one was mine too. Huh. That was about to get ugly. I'm happy to see you're finally seeing the world outside the barrier. So, be a little more happy then. Stop pointing that thing at me. Well, I got a little less happy when I saw this. Hey, it's up to 10,000 gold. Nice. I didn't think when you quit the Knights that you'd take up a life of crime. <laughs> A lot of things have happened, Flynn. It's not that simple. Simple or not, a crime is a crime. Good to see you're as stubborn as always. I... Uh-oh. Yuri, I heard something happened. Are you all... Perfect timing. Flynn! Huh? Oh, Flynn, are you all right? Have you been hurt? I I'm fine. Um, Lady Estelise. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I was just so happy to see you. I. Please, this way. What? Uh, but, Flynn, there's something I need to tell you! I better go find Carol and Rita. Bam! Happy reunion. All right, let me go buy that shit again from this person. Welcome, have a look at our wares. Okay, gotta get those, holy bottle. Buy five mats again. Did I buy? Oh yeah. Taxes are high and the shop is not profitable. Could you please buy more? Alright, the reason why I cut it up was because if you recall the last time I saved was way back when I beat that boss. Instead of saving right before I entered the town, which I did this playthrough. So, which I did this time. That way, if I did die to those bandits again, which I almost did because I refused to heal. If I did die to those bandits again, then I wouldn't have to go all the way back and do it again. Because it was like 20 minutes of replaying. And I didn't even fight as much as I did the first time, so it was annoying. But yeah, I went back and I... Or I, you know, pushed through it and I got back to the spot that I died in, which was very annoying. These people I, I talked to in the last playthrough, so you all know. Although this person I didn't, so let's see. Welcome to the port of Kapua. Kapua is divided into Nor. Is it Kapua or Kapu? I don't know. I think they said it once, but I didn't fucking pay. I don't remember. Kapu Nor is Kapu is divided into Nor to the south and Torm to the north. 
This is the south side, Capu Noor. Are you travelers? Watch out, the magistrates in the city are evil. Not only do they take taxes from their citizens, they also make travelers pay. Our magistrates are evil, they don't have second thoughts when murdering people. You shouldn't stick around if you think it's going to be dangerous. Nor and Torm are both very spirited towns, however, due to the magistrate. Damn, someone needs to fucking assassinate that dude. Ow, ow, ouch, my stomach hurts. Ooh. Whimper. Aw, that's sad. Some guy just dragged the stell right by us. Are they both inside the inn? Uh-oh. Hopefully they didn't hit that bedroom. <laughs> Are they both inside the inn? Yep, so that other guy was Flynn then. Was Flynn then. Yeah, well... You might not be able to get a word in edgewise if you went in now. It seemed like they might be in there a while. Want to burn time walking around town a bit? Sure, okay. You're not coming with me? Is that guy with the serious look your friend? Hmm, I guess not. You were being chased by a guy with red eyes? Yuri, what did you do this time? Now, let's look around town some more. So apparently I'm jealous of Flynn. Welcome, or so I'd like to be able to say that the Trino liner service isn't operating right now. The magistrate says he'll sink any ship that sets out. Can you believe that? What the hell is this? Oh, is that that food guy? Yeah. Guess you found me, you're pretty good. I'll teach you to cook as a reward. Learn the recipe for sherbet or sorbet, sorbet, I think some people pronounce it. I'll give you this so you can practice. Obtain three sets of ingredients for the recipe. Gotta go till we meet again. Is sorbet the same thing as fucking sherbet? I don't know. But yeah, I'm evidently jealous of Flynn. Because fucking, let's go check on Flynn and Estelle. Because, um, evidently we think, or Yuri thinks that they're getting a little too, too cozy. Check. Wanted vicious fugitive at large, dressed in black with front buttons open, the male, long black hair. If seen, contact the Imperial Imperial Knights at once. Oh, I can't talk to the kitty? That was obviously the wanted poster for me. Because I can't fucking button up my tunic. My cloak. business do you have at the Consular's Mansion? Oh, I can't go. I can't talk to this guy. Is that guy always the one that answers me? Yep. Alright, looks like I'm ready to talk to fucking Flynn and Estelle. Who are thick as thieves right now. But yeah, so... Uh, <laughs> I think I'm jealous of Flynn because I'm supposed to be developing feelings for Estelle. So when they, when she's like super excited to see him, I'm a little jealous, you know. But I'm trying to play it off. That's why Rita said that comment about, is he your friend? And then I was like, yes, not, because I guess I was given like a hurt look. That's my take on it. We'll see. Should we go inside? Yeah. Reunite with Carol, Rita, and Rapide. And now we're going in. I guess the Empire likes to throw its weight around no matter where you go. Before I left the capital, I didn't know or care about anything besides the lower quarter. 
It's not everywhere, but I feel like the Empire's influence is especially strong on Elikia. They can do whatever they want since there aren't any major guilds on Elikia. We can't just let it stay this way. Looks like there might be an assassination. Anyways, let me save it. Um, anyways, if thank you to my one subscriber who is probably watching this, and um, if I have any other subscribers who actually watch this, then thank you. Um, other than that, um, this is or please like, comment, and subscribe if you like the content. I know I don't really have to say that, but I feel like it can't hurt. <laughs> it can't fucking hurt. But um, yeah, I mean, thank you for watching, and this is Willie signing out. Peace out. Take it easy.